In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the Bavarian Technique tool to capture a data log of your BMW E92 M3. The capture log will capture data as you are driving from the AFR, that's air fuel ratio, spark advance, and intake air temperature, IAT. If you haven't already done so, you'll want to get the data log configuration file from my website. Go to www.rcollins.org slash public. Click on the Bavarian Technique link and download the file DinoTest with IAT.xml. The contents of the file are really simple and it shows you what we are going to capture. We're going to capture engine speed, induced air temperature bank one, throttle valve, that's your throttle body position, actual gear, those two values, throttle valve position and actual gear, will help us identify the location of the um, log of the data log that you just captured. We're also going to capture ambient air temperature, although that's optional. Uh, lambda, actual value for banks one and two, that is will be converted to your IAT, and the angle of ignition for cylinder one. We're going to load that file into the Bavarian Technique tool in the engine section. You're going to click on engine, then click on actual values, then over in the options tab up on the screen, there will be an option to load the configuration file. As soon as you load the configuration file, it will immediately start collecting data similar to what you see on this screen. I recommend that you run the car from 2500 or 2000 RPMs all the way up to redline in fourth gear, whether you're a DCT or a six speed. If you run through the gears, you know, just, you know, two, three, four, five, six, you're not going to spend any more than 2500 RPMs in any given gear. So that'll make the data logs not very useful. It's much better to, uh, to, to get your car into, say, fourth gear slow down to 2500 RPMs, then accelerate all the way to redline. As soon as you're done accelerating to redline, there's an option to stop the data capture and then export the data to an Excel spreadsheet. It's that simple. In the next video, I'll show you how to take the Excel spreadsheet from the Bavarian Technique tool and make some very nice graphs that will show you the AFR, Spark, and intake air temperature.